so today I want to show you how uh, an existing vending machine can be made smart using our uh, a smart hardware device. Uh, why are we calling this hard, smart hardware devices? Because it has a capability to understand what's there inside the machine. So you can see all the products will be listed over here. And uh, so all the all the items are listed for the customer uh, customer to select. Also, this device uh, form factor is not going to be the same. It is going to look like something like this. This is our actual design going to be. Uh, right now, this is just a prototype version. So, uh, so the customer adds the item. Let's say I have added two items. Now, you want, you want to check out. So, tap on proceed to cart. Now, it's, it's a very, very familiar screen which a customer is currently aware of because of the e-commerce transactions happening on mobile phones so he knows that okay everything I have added in the cart now I need to check out so you do a check out and this is the beauty of this uh, smart machine till now most of the almost all vending machines in India are not able to accept digital payments so we have uh, incorporated all kind of digital payments in this machine so we have a pay by online facility so in case a customer is interested it's just by paying online because most of these guys have their own accounts or cards stored in various pay, uh, uh, payment mechanism or the customer can pay by physical cards when I'm talking about the physical card credit card or debit card so how does that happen let me show you so okay I want to pay by card I tap on pay by card then the machine says okay what's uh, it's connecting it's connecting now it's uh, so, so the machine is connected with a credit card swiping power area which is eventually is going to look like this when it comes final design so here the swiping will happen a card or the punching thing so let me go ahead and do insert the card I've done that so now I have inserted the card the machine uh, so it shows that hey uh, the two products cost 20 bucks now press enter key so I enter now I have to put in my uh, obviously the, the uh, pin numbers so I will go ahead and put in my pin number double seven and enter so I have entered the pin now the payment is being processed and it should be done so it says okay now you're done you remove your card so i have taken out my card and now you see automatically it will start vending those products so these two products and the progress of the vending can be easily seen on the on the, on the screen area so right now this product is in progress so we can see over here which particular spiral is going to move so this is the one which vended just now my Pepsi area and now let's so the status also will change it's down done the second product is being vended now and so this is the second product which is being vended so we saw that the first one was this one the second one is this and both the products status will be done so it's it's done and it says thank you for shopping so I got the product and move on so this this is the seamless transaction which we are trying to show that wherever the machine is parked a person can just walk in select the product type in put in the card or whatever the payment mechanism they want we do have wallet payments as well like Paytm and Mobiquake or free charge anything can be can be used to pay and they make the payment take the product and go out now one of the most important thing about being smart is just not buying, uh, just not giving the ability to make payment, but also understanding what's going on in machine. So we will be able to understand what product, what inventory we have, what is whether machine is working or not working. We will also be able to give a lot of other reports to vending machine operators. Another important feature is since we are giving, providing a big screen. Now this 
enables us to help vending operators push promotional materials as well. So for an example, you say that I have got a petri bottle but the inventory is too much and I want to liquidate it. So you can run a promo that today anyone of uh, taking Pepsi bottles 5 rupees off. Now that can be visible on the screen and a user can add that also in their cart. So that helps in liquidating the inventory and getting more sale. Okay, so in case, uh, so we have digital payments but we have not cut off the uh, existing payment mechanism which is using the currency itself. So if somebody still wants to make a payment using the uh, existing currency, they can straight away go and do as it is and select the product. And that's it. So it started vending. So basically, this solution works with all kind of payments existing as well as the new. So this is the this is the overall thing. This is a complete prototype as of now. We are in a process to make a final product like this. Thank you.